Hello, 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 hello. Guess where I am? Ooh. I am under the elk arches in Town Square of Jackson, Wyoming. We're in town. It's kind of fun. So anyway, I wanted to pop in, see if I could find myself. Oh, so let me give you before I find a little spot to sit. So here's the elk arches, right? It's kind of cool. So let me give you a little idea of elks naturally fall, they shed, they are like nails. Horns, you gotta kill the animal with it. So when you're actually buying something, you see something is made of horn or made of antler. Antler is much more humane than horn, just a little tip. Anyway, so um, this video is about seeing things with different eyes. Eyes. And part of it is, it got me thinking, because we've been coming out to Jackson here. This is, I guess I've been coming here for 22 years. <laughs> my son has been coming out here for 20, since he's a baby. And my husband is the one who's a skier, came out here, God, maybe 30 years ago, and fell in love with skiing and bought our place out here, which we've hence renovated. So when we come out here, you know, it's a small town and Things are kind of always the same, but they're also really different. Things are changing, stores come and go. It's gotten much more modern than it used to be. And it is a different vibe than it was maybe 10 years ago or 15 years ago, but it still is pretty much, I don't want to get these people in the video. It still is pretty much the same thing. So it's about looking at stuff at different eye, with different eyes. So when you're looking at stuff with different eyes, you're seeing it a different way. And that's the same thing as not only where you live, where you vacation, but also in your photos. I'm gonna let this car go, truck. but also in your photos, in your videos, in your brand. So when you're looking at stuff the same way all the time, you don't see what's new about it. You don't see maybe what's classic about it. You don't see what needs to be maybe refurbished, tweaked or fine tuned, but you always need to look at stuff with fresh eyes. And if you wanna learn how in today's like super crazy crowded market, how to really stand out and set yourself up in your business, in your brand, in a snap, like in your photos when you're doing a live video like this, or if, when you're doing your headshots and your photos and you're being really real and connecting on social media and on your website and all your imagery and even for me it was my book cover I invite you to go over to AuthenticSuperstar.com that's AuthenticSuperstar.com it's my free five-day challenge which won't be free for long so get over there right now while it is and join me but you know it's it, sometimes we, we look at stuff and it gets so boring like we look at this like one jewelry store that we just passed here when we parked the car and I'm like I can't believe that the store is here for that long and they have the ugliest dinkiest trinkety kind of stuff and as my husband said well someone must like it and it's true you know and it's like looking at things with different eyes so this store that has like this really nasty jewelry there's people who come here in the summer by droves and they want to buy a piece of this little cheap jewelry where there's other stores here that have like really fine stuff that's much more expensive and they probably don't have the same um, mass appeal. So that's the same thing with your brand. You know, if you're positioning yourself to be sort of cheap and go to the masses, well, that's okay, but then you're not gonna have the same type of customer, the same type of clientele, if you were buy, if you were positioning yourself to be more high end. So it's it really is use. You know, like meets like, birds of a feather flock together. So I may not find any interest in that jewelry store, but totally other people do. So you know, when you're positioning yourself and putting yourself out there in your videos and your imagery and your branding, keep in mind like who do you want to attract and what does that appeal to. To. So if you want to know more, then go over to AuthenticSuperstar.com, AuthenticSuperstar.com. I'm more than happy to take you with me for five days. And that's about it. Let me try to turn a bit here the other way. So that's a little bit corner of town. And now in the park, see every corner of the park has these antlers. So there's one over there. 
this is right in the middle of town square and right there in the center there's an ice skating rink now which is super cool and if you go over there there's the million dollar cowboy bar let me see do a little walking tour here um it's snowing so i I'm gonna walk super fast. I'll show you the cowboy. Maybe later in the week, if we go to the cowboy bar, I'll come in and show you that. So, I gotta go around the ice skating rink to see if I can get you a good shot of this cowboy. See, there's another doing some construction there. It's another set of ant antler arches. There's another set of antler arches. There is another set of antler arches. Oh, let me tell you something really funny. If you, one of the biggest things on YouTube was they had, see right up there, there's a webcam and it's the Jackson Hole webcam. For some reason, became quite the thing of people going there and just watching other people cross traffic. Isn't it hilarious? It's on YouTube, it's all over drugstore and then right here you see that that is the million dollar cowboy bar which is quite the thing here it's a real hoot gotta be 21 to get in there so kid won't be going in there just yet with us that's hoping but not too much here it's really funny it's super western there's some more antlers and it's kind of town right it's just kind of put it back on me. Okay, I'm back. So anyway, so that's it. It's a little little kind of tour of Town Square in Jackson Hole. And just, you know, keep in mind that you can always look at stuff differently with fresh eyes, see it a different way, show up, stand out, and realize that maybe, you know, sometimes you're looking at something for so long, you can't see the forest for the trees and you need another set of eyes on it. And sometimes, you know, you're seeing it so long that you don't even pay attention to it, that you don't even realize how much it needs to be fine-tuned, spruced up, and it's just no longer serving you or being modern. So whatever it is, please, I invite you to go over to AuthenticSuperstar.com Let's get together and really make sure that you learn to be empowered, to take your best photos, to set up your branding, to model yourself, to create an authentic visual message that tells the world exactly what you want to see. So that's it. I'm going to see you guys later. Oh my God. If you like this, I always forget to say that. Don't forget to share with a friend. And if you also enjoy it, you know, make sure you turn on the notifications over here and you'll know the next time I go live so we can interact. Okay, folks. See you later. Bye.